I almost called someone a bad word today on social media. Um, I didn't because I, I don't do that. That's not who I am, yeah. and it's not good for my brand. But yeah. it's like eventually I said, I call bull shark on this. You're spreading falsehoods as truth. Um, have you ever heard of the show called Strong Opinion Sports? Do you know the difference between an opinion and a fact? Yeah. Yep. What's, what's simple? Just what do you think the difference is? A, a, a fact is uh, you can't dispute a fact. Like when Cam Newton was released by the Carolina Panthers, it is what it is. I, I can say my opinion was he didn't get released, but that's just wrong because factually he did get released by the Carolina Panthers. Yep. It's an inarguable fact. Yeah, you jump off a building, even though everybody likes science, uh, gravity, you will fall. Yeah, that's fact. Yeah. Whereas an opinion is here's what I think is happening. And it's so frustrating to me that in this whole crisis, people are make confusing the difference between a fact and opinion, and they're sharing opinions as facts. Um, f- for example, you don't know whether or not you have coronavirus. Nope. Yeah, you're not sick. No. You haven't been around anybody has, that you know has had coronavirus. Nope. So you may or may not. But just because you're not presenting symptoms doesn't mean you don't have it. The only way to know is to test you. Yep. You could theoretically, this is a thing. And they wouldn't with, test me, by the way. They wouldn't test you. <laughs> and, and and this could, there are people we don't know yet about coronavirus that have that have that are just carriers. They never get sick. They just spread it to everybody. So who knows if you have it or not? Who knows if you're spreading to everybody or not? So that's a that's unknown. Um, have you ever had the flu? I, I don't, not that I know of. I think maybe once in my lifetime, but it might have been food poisoning. It was pretty bad. Yeah. It was I, we were at Chris Columbus's house for the 2006 Super Bowl. Yep. When Peyton Manning beat the Bears, I was really sick on the couch at Chris Glombus's house. Okay. Miserable. So I've, I've had the flu a couple times. And did you know that coronavirus is a virus? Sure. Did you know the flu is a virus? Yeah. When you get the flu in 2018, it doesn't make you immune, immune from the flu in 2019 or 2020. Because it mutates and changes. And it's not like a – you get chickenpox once and you never worry about chickenpox again. What, what I've heard about the coronavirus, if I get coronavirus now, I could still get it again in the fall. Maybe. maybe, but but it doesn't mean I'm go- done with it forever. Is my point, right? Like, well, but we don't know. Mm. You may or may not get immunity. That's what they're talking about. You may yeah. get coronavirus, and maybe you get immunity. Maybe you don't. We just don't know. Those are those are that's hoped. Yeah. They suspect. They believe. They think likely, but they just don't know. And there's so many of these things that people are relying on that are this this thing's going to kill a lot of people. I hope I'm wrong, but I, I wouldn't be surprised if by the time we're done in the next 12 months that we have somewhere between 500,000 and a million deaths in the United States of America for coronavirus. And I hope yeah. and pray I'm wrong, but that will not surprise me. But people are making life change decisions based on life or death decisions based on opinions that aren't yet facts. It's a, Do you know why they call it a novel virus? Uh, I think it's because it's there's no way to cure it yet. Because it's stupid. It, it, the medical community is dumb when it comes to marketing and branding. It's a <laughs> term that means new. Got it. Brand new. Brand. It's a brand new virus. Got that, it. So when did it appear? You can argue the date in November, or date in December, but it hasn't uh, the date in November or date in December, but it hasn't been around very long. And we don't have any actual scientific facts to say here's what happened.